glow. You wanna see me have a fucking mental breakdown? Okay, um, no. <laughs> My great grandmother's funeral is tomorrow, or today, because it's midnight. I haven't taken my medicine. I need to. Um, and to be quite honest with you, I don't want to talk. Um, <laughs> like, I don't want to leave my house. Period. Like, I'm really fucking sad. <laughs> And it's like hitting me like really suddenly. Cause I can sure bust that shit like down <laughs> for like the last two days. Um, but I'm really sad. Like I'm super sad, but I'm also like really manic. So it's <laughs> so we just kinda in a weird place right now. I keep taking my medicine like later and later and later and you know or like drinking coffee is just like I'm feeling that I'm like actually manic and like ooh, this shit's not fun um um but yeah I'm sad yeah I'm sad and um for like the past two days people have been calling me talking about my grandmother is gonna die um telling me that I need to like make funeral arrangements and um I don't really want to do that because yeah fuck no <laughs> shit at this point granddaughter is either gonna live forever or somebody else is paying her because I'm not I'm not doing it I'm not doing that again like I I refuse. I. I literally refuse. Um. Like I don't want her to die, and I'm tired of people like calling the phone and talking about she's gonna die, and it's just like, and it's like even though it's a possibility that she's gonna die, you know, anytime soon, it's like I'm like the only one who actually like recognizes that that's a possibility and can like think about it sensibly even though I'm the one that it would like affect the most like if she did die because if she did die then I would fucking like lose my ever loving shit and this <sighs> honestly I probably have to go back to the psych ward because <laughs> <laughs> gee I'm gonna be a fucking mess tomorrow <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> I'm being surrounded by people who I don't really like slash don't know. And I'm, I'm going to be a fucking mess. And my brother's probably going to be talking to me about chicken nuggets. And that might be my only point of levity. I'm like actually spiraling right now. I'm really fucking sad. <laughs> Why do people keep dying? <laughs> like, I'm only 21. <laughs> Why have I had so many experiences with death? I don't... I don't, <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> and, like, I gotta fucking wear a dress that doesn't even, like, fucking fit me. Uh um... I wear my fucking dress that I got, like... When I was like 18 for Mother's Day. Because it's like the only nice dress I own. Well, I own two other ones. But it's just like I don't want to wear another. Because it's like the only other dress I have. Or like the one that I wore to my mom's funeral. And it doesn't really fit me. Because they're really small. And we like ball size. That was like bigger than me. I don't think I should go. Like. Like I want to go. Like, I really want to go. Because she was like, because my great grandma was like, she's like one of the only, she was like one of the family members who made sure that I was like included. We made sure I felt loved. But not everyone did that, you know? And. Like, she died when I was in the psych ward. 
And I don't really, I don't really have time to like process that. And I don't want to go. I just, I just wanna, I just wanna color, play video games, and watch Doctor Who, and pretend that Gregory's not gonna die soon. Or that my mom's only a call away. Or that I'm not fucking alone living in a house by myself. 